Okay, after some debugging, I found out what the issue was. So there were two issues. Um, the first one being that uh, in one of our JSON classes, when we create the player JSON object, um, we actually wanted to rename this to be enemy spawn points. Otherwise, it just makes player spawn points have the enemy spawn points as well. Uh, so let's fix that one, and then also in the uh, on play uh, method, um, I messed up over there. Instead of doing game object dot find, we actually wanted to instantiate. So instantiate player position rotation as game object. And this one is actually local, so we want to set that to true over here. So I also have the server running over here. We can clear this out. And then I'll start the client again, and we'll try again. So I'll call it player1. And we can see that the player is there, but it for some reason it created light another player. I don't know why there's a player two there. That is strange. Uh, let me just restart the uh, server. Try this again. Okay, so you will be player one. Okay, I think there was just a WebSocket connection that was still lingering. Um, so yeah, I mean, uh, that part's working pretty good. Um, all right, so we fixed that. So, yeah, I mean, you can see that the name was showing up there and, and all that. Um, so that's working pretty good. I think, I think like, uh, next we can go ahead and um, figure out. So at, at this point, um, we need to do move, turn, shoot, health change, and dis... Okay, we, do, we didn't have disconnect. We definitely need to... That's why we we're seeing player two there, player two there. Uh, let, let's make sure that we uh, we get that one out of the way because it's gonna gonna cause issues if we don't. So um, so that'll be string data equals socket io event. Data dot to string user JSON current user JSON move user JSON or I didn't want to do that. I'm looking at the wrong one. So here we're gonna destroy that player. So if they disconnect, we are gonna do that. 
by finding their name. So that's how we can destroy them. Um, data dot to string. Um, so yeah, so we can test that um, by Let's build this. So we can now want to add main there. And then uh, where do I want to put this? I create a folder here called um, build. And then um, call it uh, node for Mac. Okay, so while it's doing that, um, let's kind of tell you what, what's going to happen. So we, we are going to uh, let me just uh, do a build and run here. We're going to have uh, two clients there, so you, you should be able to see that in action. So, oh crap, I didn't want to do that. Uh, sorry. I wanted to do windowed so you could see what's going on. There. Uh, no. Yeah, quit. There. All right. So yeah, so we have two two players um, about to join the network. So we don't have the um, player movement, player turn, player shoot, player health hooked up yet, um, but we should be able to uh, see uh, both players. Uh, so you, you'll notice that like when I move this guy, it doesn't update the other one yet because we haven't hooked that up yet, right? And we haven't hooked up the health yet either. So uh, I think this is a pretty good stopping point. So, um, you know, in the next video, we'll be doing move, turn, shoot, and then health. <clears throat>